I'm a 19 year old computer science student sharing my journey to become a software developer. Today in this video I will show you how to deploy React app on Netlify. Or in other words, how to put your project online, so you can share the link with other people. I'm going to use one of my old React projects, it's a simple React to do app and you can go on the github repository to get started. To download this project, all you have to do is click on this download SD button and then you can extract the folder on your desktop. So to get started, the first thing that we need is our React project. You can use your own React project or you can download uh, this React to do project. I will leave the link of this repository in the video description. And to download the project, you simply have to click on code, click on download zip and then open the files. Make sure you select this folder and click on extract to. We are going to select desktop and click on OK. So now we have our project downloaded on our desktop and then we need to open Visual Studio Code. So here we are on Visual Studio Code. Click on open folder and select the folder that we downloaded. Click on select folder. So here we have our folder. Here are all the components. Then the next step that you're going to make is click on terminal and click on new terminal. If you just downloaded the project, make sure you click on npm install. So you can download all the packages so you won't uh, get any error. Click on enter. And wait until this finish. After all the packages have been downloaded, the next step that we are going to make is open a new terminal. Simply click on this button. And then we have to run another command, which is npm run build. And this is going to create a, a new folder, which is the build folder, which we are going to use later on Netlify to deploy our project. So after this has been completed, click on uh, new terminal again, and we need to run our project to show you what it's look like. To do that, click on npm start, click on control and click on link. So here is our React app. Is a simple react to do app. The next step is going to be creating an account on Netlify. Go to Netlify, not Netflix. Search Netlify and go to Netlify.com. I will leave the link of this website in the video description. So here is the Netlify website. So if you don't have an account, make sure you sign up or if you have one, click on login. If you don't have an account, make sure you sign up, click on sign up and you can sign up with GitHub or you can just sign up with your email. I'm going to sign up with my GitHub account, click on sign up with GitHub so, and here is our dashboard. So to import our website, we simply have to click on sites and here you have two options import an existing projects or start from a template. If you want, you can import your project directly from grid, but we are going to use the manually deploy. So if you want to deploy a new site, we have to drag and drop uh, our site output folder here, which is the build folder that we created and click on browse to upload and simply go to desktop where we have our folder. So here is our folder to do react master and then select this build folder click on upload again click on upload and it's uploading you need to wait and don't refresh the page so here we have our website to visit our website click on this link so here is our website and we can copy the link and share it with other people. I will leave the link of this React to do up on the video description. Then you can set up your site. After your site is deployed, you can set up a custom domain and secure your site with HTTPC. Make sure to leave a comment if you want me to make a video about how to create this React to do up 
And also, if you found this video helpful, leave a like and subscribe with notifications on, so you won't miss any video. Peace out.